Lucky Lindy coming at you from my living room. So we just went to the salt cave. I wasn't able to take any kind of video in there. They they make you put away your electronics, which is good because it's a nice, relaxing experience. You just get to sit in a zero gravity chair in a salt cave and it just feels really good. So they gave us a special where we got a salt scrub and a lip gloss and two sessions for less than what normal two sessions would cost. So we went with that, of course, because <laughs> why not? All right, um, other than that, this week, I did an unboxing with you. We'll see if that's something that you enjoy. I did get a whole nother thing from the auction. I got a whole bunch of mirrors and some jugs from the auction, so I can always show you that. We'll go through that and see the auction haul that we had this week. Other than that, it's going to be kind of a smaller vlog because I don't have a lot of footage and I did put up a lot of shorts this week. Hi, Lucky Lindy coming at you from my dining room. When I got home from North Carolina, I had all of these packages waiting for me and I thought that it would be important for us to look and see what Ipsy sent us this week. And maybe we can open the ones from Amazon. It's probably not that exciting, but I thought maybe we could just see a little bit of an unboxing of our Ipsy. All right, so what we got this week from Ipsy is we've got this cute pouch. It's a pink pouch with a gold heart. I love it with a little black ribbon. And this time, the things that are inside are, we have probiotic moisturizer from Feel. We have a silicone primer from Ofra. I've been wanting to try this. This is for eyeshadow to put on your, your eyelids so that your eyeshadow stays on. We've got, you know how I love this. We've got lip oil and this one is from Lottie and I'm very excited to try this one. So I always love a good lip oil. And then we have a perfume. It's a Barbie perfume. I like it. I would have never bought this ever in, in a million years. This is what's so cool about Ipsy is you, you find things that you would never have in your toiletries or in your cosmetics. All right, and the last thing that we have from Ipsy is Dr. Brandt eye cream. Oh, you know how I need that. I have these bags that under my eyes at all times. I've, and I've had them since I was like two, probably before that. But that's when I remember the first time thinking, I have bags under my eyes. I was like two. <laughs> oh, anyway, and then we also got the box. So let's take a look and see what is in here. Oh, I just stabbed my, my table. Oh Lord, help us all. I don't need to be stabbing my table. All right. And what we have in our, I think that this one is called the boxy charm. I did want these. I wanted these cute brushes. So I don't know, you y'all had seen me do some cleaning of my brushes. So basically I thought I need some more brushes. So I got a couple of brushes. We've got Clarity Serum from Dallas and James. Dallas and James Skincare. It's Watermelon Dream. I love it. I wouldn't have known about any of this. So there you have it. And then we do have another recovery treatment oil. You know, I am just crazy over oil. I use oil morning and night on my face after I wash. And this one is Malin and Goats. Uh, gets Malin and Gets G-O-E-T-Z recovery treatment oil. See, these are things that I would not have known about and that's what I love about Ipsy is that it's fun and it's something different. This is from Tees. Oh, this is the, the eye primer. I'm sorry, the other one is just a face primer. This one is the eye primer Tees Suit of Armor Battle Prep Eye Primer. So this is something I've really wanted to try. And then the last thing that we got is a pressed powder from Glow Wish by Huda Beauty and it is called Luminous and in a colored pan because as you all know, 
it's just about to be spring here and we will be getting darker because that's the way it is. I will be out there gardening. I'll be out in the pool. I'll be doing all the things that spring and summer bring. And I do get darker. And I have to say that I do like having a little free vitamin D, getting out there in the sunshine, getting some vitamin D. And I also do sometimes in the winter, I do like to go and do the self tan. And I know some people are going to think that it's not good for you. It's something that you shouldn't be doing. And I understand that. I get that. And the fact is, is that I do like to do it. And I used to go to the tanning bed. So at least I don't do that at this point. I'm just doing the, the self tanning. Okay. This is from, this is just my box that I got from Amazon and it's really it's not that interesting but it's it's kind of interesting I did get this new hairbrush I just wanted to try it I saw it I thought I don't know it looks kind of interesting so I thought well let me try it so let's see what it looks like I thought I got that cut Oh, and they sent me a teasing comb. Ah, that's pretty cool because that's actually a, a steel handle teasing comb. So that's nice to have because, you know, I am a child of the 80s. So I do tease my hair every once in a while. Okay, so this is a really neat brush and I'm just trying it out. See if we like it or not. And it is called Ahem and it's Soft Mild is the name of the of the brand. And then I did get a pair of pajamas. They're a silky kind of pajamas. I did want one more pair of pajamas. I know, I may have a problem. There may be some problems in this world that I have. Oh, did I get rid of my scissors? I think I put my scissors on the ground here. Oh well, we'll have to get, I have to get out the editing device. <laughs> All right, and then, I also bought two books. I do want you to know, I've been reading, right now I'm reading Little Wing. Before that, I read The Luckiest Girl Alive. They're good books. I like them very much. Sometimes I just like a little fun murder mystery. And these are supposed to be in Wisconsin. They're supposed to be based in Wisconsin, which that is where I am from originally. I was born in Wisconsin. Like many people that are of Nordic heritage, for some reason, they came from Sweden and they were like, oh, here, this looks good. Let's stop here in Minnesota, South Dakota, Wisconsin. I mean, really? Come on. Too cold, man. Too cold for me. I, that's why I live in the South. So these are by Michelle Parisa Wasik. And one is called The Murder Before Christmas and one is called Ice Cold Murder. And they're a Charlie Kingsley mystery. So, yeah, I like little soft, fun stuff sometimes. I also, I read a lot. So I read all sorts of different things the the luckiest girl alive is a pretty dark book and usually i don't really love that kind of thing but it was it kept moving it was a mover and a shaker so i like that about it the other thing i bought is i got some shorts for walking I got some Eddie Bauer walking shorts because they went on sale on Amazon. They were only, they were down to like $33. Were they $33? Yeah. They were somewhere around $33. I don't know if you all do that, but I put things in my Amazon cart, save for later. And then they alert me when they go on sale and I go, okay, let's do it. And you know, I didn't need them over the winter when they were $55. So when they went down to 33, that's when I bought that color and i did buy another pair in black and i do have a pair in black that i already am using and so i know that i like them and that i will use them often so that's my pair in black the eddie bauer eddie bauer walking shorts i also purchased a sweater deep pillar because i do have some sweaters that have some piling they have some pilling, I'm sorry, not piling, they have pilling on them. 
And so this is supposed to just shave that off and keep it looking fresh and brand new. And I, I don't know about you, but I tend to see that on my cashmere the most. So I'm gonna keep that, see if it works. Hopefully it works. And then this is something that Dr. Art bought me for Valentine's Day. And as you know, I was out on the road and I didn't get to open it. And it is a Michael Kors watch that we purchased off of Amazon or Art, Dr. Art purchased off of Amazon. And I've been excited for it. And it's here and it's gorgeous. It has some, it has some packing on it, but we'll just kind of put it on, basically put it on for you. I love it. I will be wearing it with my gold jewelry. And I mean, I just couldn't ask for something cuter. I love it. I'm going to wear it a lot. All right, guys, that's it. That's what came while I was gone out in North Carolina. I'm home in Murfreesboro, Tennessee, and it is cold very cold here and hopefully it'll warm up very quickly my poor little daffodils are all peeked out and they're all looking around and they're like ah it's very cold so hopefully this will end and they will be able to continue peeking and it looks like the next thing to come up is going to be my since are the next thing that are to come up all right and then of course we'll have lilacs and then roses and our hydrangeas Peonies will be in there. I'm going to go and buy another couple of peonies and plant them next to my current peonies and see if that helps them to propagate and be bigger because that's something that I learned in my getting ready for gardening class was that if we put peonies together, they tend to like it and they tend to grow more. So we'll see if that works. Hi, Lucky Lindy coming at you from the Serenity Salt Cave. So we're going in here to go ahead and sit in the salt cave and detox a little bit. Q1 detox is something I made up. It means quarter one. So that just means that for the first three months of the year, we're doing things to, to detox our bodies. So Q1 detox, here we go. Salt cave. Call and they are so dirty and so icky that I've left them out here with St. Francis watching over them because I'm gonna to have to clean them with the hose but it's been really cold so I haven't been able to do that and this is one of the mirrors that I got in my latest haul the second mirror and then I got four of these antique mirrors and it doesn't look like they have hanging devices, but I'll have to figure that out. Okay, I know, it's a very, very messy garage. I just wanted to thank everybody. I can't believe it, we're at 322 subscribers. Our goal was to get to 300 by the end of February, 500 by May. Thank you so much, and please subscribe, like, comment, and share. We would love to talk with all of y'all. Bye. Okay. Okay. La la la. La la la.